he have a five speed transmission in his car he have a nag transmission in his car some of you all know what the nag that car uh i think the year was a 09 it's going to have either a nag or 42r e transmission installed but he has the nag because i um i looked it up he has a nag transmission well the problem you having is he can't seem to find the tcm so y'all know me if i can shoot a quick video faster than i can texting all this information i might as well do that and that's exactly what i'm doing so this uh let me take this out this uh challenger dodge challenger it's, it's gonna be the same thing as the uh, charger and uh the magnum if your car equipped with a nag transmission ladies and gentlemen here is your tcm okay uh let me get you a good view of this in fact let me turn this camera this way all right here is your tcm okay it is totally different from uh the other cars 42 re uh re will have the tcm functions inside of the pcm you know we use a uh, we uh some of our next generation some of chrysler next generation controllers uh t handle both functions the engine and the transmission so but the nag is like a unique transmission <laughs> in that uh it has its own separate transmission control module and this is it it is housed under the steering wheel okay as y'all can see i'm under the steering wheel all you have to do is remove of course the cover and this little bracket here that's if you're replacing it now i didn't get into specific why he's looking for it or why he's fixing to replace it but the question uh that uh seemed to be pointing toward replacing it and he didn't know where it was so actually not that he didn't know where it was he thought it was part of the controller it is not this is your nag transmission uh tcm right here uh just held on by this if you're replacing this held on by two about three screws little phillip head screws okay again i have no idea why you need to know that it would be interesting to know because i have yet to replace one of these ever okay y'all know how a controller work you need three things for a controller work to work uh, power supply ground and uh the bus network need to be active okay that is pretty much uh, a lot of people are replacing controllers for absolutely no reason at all i mean uh it got to a point one time the dealership uh chrysler <laughs> sent us to special training to uh be able to diagnose these because a lot of people was replaced they was guessing you see what i'm saying they was guessing and uh they they guess was very expensive they was making expensive guess and half of the time they were saying the controllers that we sent back there was no problem with it so uh, like i said i have no idea why you're replacing yours as you know this nag got a harness that runs underneath the car to the actual transmission okay in fact i got a tra i got a nag transmission over here on my table let's go around here and see something right quick all right uh this thing uh i ended up replacing this i don't even remember the reason why but it is this is the nag transmission and this is where the harness go into okay so i would uh if you chasing some kind of electrical problem um i would take a real good look at the harness that goes in here okay because it routes up under the transmission and it can easily rub on uh the body of the transmission so um check all your electrical wiring before you go just replacing a, a TCM uh, in this car okay so yes that's exactly what I would do now here's where he got stuck at he he's like I got the module out and uh this where the module the PCM is housed now on other cars you will have one connector missing okay if your car is equipped with an egg transmission that fourth connector which is green uh that was uh that's the connector reserved for transmission functions okay i don't want to pull this control out but if you look down there there's only three connectors on this a typical chrysler pcm has four but because this transmission has a nag or this car has a nag transmission in it all the transmission functions are 
inside the TCM, okay? But uh, yeah, I just happen to have one in my stall. What are we doing to this thing? I can't even remember. I am about to. Oh, this car has a has a misfire, so I got to do some diagnosing and uh, go from there. But I want to stay on topic. That nag transmission, that TCM is under the steering column, guy. So thanks for your question. Num mainly thanks for subscribing and watching the videos. I appreciate it. If y'all have any questions, please go ahead and ask. I have no problem answering questions. But uh, like I say, I probably will ask that you simply subscribe to the channel. I don't think that's too much to ask for. But that's all I have, man. I'll catch y'all on the, the next video. Thanks for watching. Comment and subscribe. And I'll see y'all on the next video.